Hi and welcome back to another video. Today we are talking about Microsoft OneNote and how you can create a bullet journal within the application. If you find this useful, please click the like button, hit subscribe, tap the bell. It does mean a lot to the channel. Um, and with that said, let's jump on into it. So the first thing that we're going to do is just head over to our OneNote. So what I've done here is I've just created a new section for the bullet journal and just created a page called bullet journal. Now obviously you might want to structure this out slightly differently um, and that's entirely up to you. What I've then done is I've actually gone over to the um, view tab and added grid lines behind it. That's not necessary, um, it's just something that I um, prefer when it comes to doing this style of journal. So. There are many different ways to approach this within OneNote. Um, I've seen examples where um, people have drawn out boxes um, just using the insert um, and basically drew shapes directly into the page, um, which is one way to go. Um, I, however, have found that that's quite time consuming and, and obviously it relies on you making sure that everything is the same size and you put all the names and things in um, correctly. Instead, I'm going to show you a shortcut um, to create this really quickly, really simply. Um, and let's get started. So the first thing that we're going to do is just jump over to our insert tab and go to pictures. Um, I've then gone ahead and found a bullet journal with um, blank uh, inserts and we're just going to insert that directly into the page. Now it's important that you use something like a PNG. Um, it's not 100% necessary, um, but go find yourself um, an image or um, use something like um, PowerPoint or uh, Word to create the structure that you would like and then just do a save as um, a PNG uh, image or a, a JPEG, something like that. Once you have your image, um, you drop it into your um, OneNote just like that. So you go to insert, go to picture, find the picture and then insert it. It will then drop it directly into the page like this. What you then want to do is just with it selected, go to the bottom right hand corner until you get the double diagonal arrow um, and then just drag the um, image until it fills the page like I've done here. Right. So now I have um, Sunday through to Saturday um, with all the various squares available. Now what we want to do is right click and then you scroll down to set picture as background. Give that a click and now our, um, our image there is the background to our page and therefore we can now type our notes directly into each specific box that we would require to do so. Now you'll end up with this um, container just here where the image used to be. We can just delete that. We don't need that anymore. And we have the um, background set. So now I can click into Sunday and just type a note directly here. Say this is a test. Uh, I can click over into Wednesday and say here is another test and so forth. Right. And we can obviously do various formatting with each of these um, from the home tab. We can go make it bold. We can increase the font size as needed. We could drop images in, uh, etc. change font colors, create to-do lists, etc. Um, and that's the shortcut, guys. If you found this um, useful, then um, hit up the like button, click subscribe, tap that bell um, if you want to be notified of all the future content that we create. Um, and I will catch you guys in the next video.